Alrighty, welcome back everyone. It's Garland here bringing you a new Neverwinter video. And as the title suggests, we're going to be talking about the latest mount skin uh, that technically came from Summer Festival. It was the one that you could buy out of the Wondrous Bazaar, uh, 3 million AD. Unless, of course, you had your discounts in the Wondrous Bazaar. All that information was in my Summer Festival video if you didn't have the chance to watch that. But we are going to be talking about the slab of Vecna. Now, uh, other content creators already put out videos on this. It, it's broken. It's definitely broken to a degree. Uh, whether or not they're going to actually take the time to fix it, who knows? Or maybe it is working as intended. Who really knows with Cryptic anymore? Uh, but definitely, right now, as it sits of filming this video, this mount power is definitely best in slot. Uh, especially for melee characters uh, because it's based off your strength and your physical damage. Uh, but even if you're a caster, you're still going to want to use this as your main form of mount power DPS. Uh, so yeah, uh, looking at the statistics uh, on the act logs, it definitely goes by your strength. So again, you know, I play an intelligence based uh, character. So my strength is only 10 uh, leading to my physical uh, damage boost of only 2.5%. So if you're a melee character, I had reports, uh, friends of mine were telling me that like in an artifact phase, uh, they were hitting upwards of 12 million, uh, 12 to 15 million. Uh, so yeah, is that intended? Who really knows? So of course we're going to be talking about the, I believe it's called, uh, Wrath something or other? I don't know. Oh, uh, Wicked. It's called the Wicked. Wicked Witch of the West. Alright. Summons a skeletal rival to assault the target, knocking them from their feet, greatly inspiring the summoner. So, it does only have uh, a magnitude of 2400, right? We're accustomed to seeing our single target mount powers being 3000 magnitude. Um, this is mythic statistics mine's mythic uh even though it's legendary on the screen i'm just inspecting a legendary one mine is mythic in game uh so it maxes out at 2400 magnitude so you would assume that it would do less damage than let's say the golden war horse or your giant toad right those are the two go-to single target dps mount powers uh pretty much up until this point um now, the bonus with this is not only are you going to do a ton of damage, but then you also increase your outgoing DPS by 15% for 10 seconds. So, it's basically a win-win. Uh, everyone should probably use this until they nerf it. Now, I wouldn't go out of your way to actually buy it. Like me, I collect mount skins, so I was going to buy it regardless of it being broken or not, right? Like, I collect mount skins in the game. If you're a new player, I wouldn't waste 3 million AD on this mount skin um, just for Cryptic to fix it. So if we just go ahead and bring up the numbers. Um, so we're looking for the Wicked. Wicked Witch of the West, right? Now, keep in mind, this act log testing was done on the preview server um, on the 30,000K training dummy. Um, and again, this is just single target, my own self deep buffs and fully buffed, right? So again, in that five-man group setting in dungeons, in that 10-man um, trowel setting with an artifact call with several debuffs going on. Uh, this thing goes nuts, okay? This this thing will go crazy. So we'll, we're looking at uh, Wicked Lich. Um, this was a four minute test. So in four minutes, it did 11.7 million damage. Uh, it was number three on my list. My Killing Flames, my Blades of the Vanquish still outperformed it overall, but it, it got number three. Okay, uh, the maximum hit was 3.3 million, which is insane. Um, in a four minute test, I cast it at four times, right? It has a minute cooldown. So, 
it's it's insane damage. That's not normal damage. It's probably not working as intended. Um, I could definitely see Cryptic eventually uh, toning it down, nerfing the damage. But there is a downfall with it. Uh, it's not taking into account your accuracy stat. So it can't just be completely deflected or majorly deflected. Uh, if we bring up like some more internal testing of this specific test here, uh, you can see that I had 76% effectiveness, but there was the one that my accuracy, uh, since accuracy, you know, doesn't count, uh, I only did 40% effectiveness. Um, so you can see the damage numbers here, 3.3 million, 3.3 million, 3.3 million. And then the one that did get basically deflected was only 1.7 million. So it does have a downfall. It's like a 50, 50% 50 chance that you're going to do the maximum amount of damage or your attack's going to be deflected. So looking further into it, it appears that it's basically taking your combat advantage and doubling it. So let's say you have 90% combat advantage. It's basically just doubling your combat advantage. So it's definitely broke. Uh, it's probably scripted wrong. Um, you know, go figure. Cryptic scripted something wrong. But as it sits right now, who knows how long it'll be before they do take the time to fix it. So again, this test was only my debuffs right this is one player this is a four minute test so again in like a trial setting uh i had uh, a ranger friend say you know he was doing anywhere from 12 to 15 million damage which is just insane so just for comparison if we look at that uh at the toad for instance if we bring up the toad again uh same stipulations this was a four and a half minute test uh, and we're looking for the giant toad tongue lash. So again, was only cast four times, but you can see the damage difference. It's 7.6 million compared to the 11.7 million. So it's basically doing way more damage currently uh, than any mount power that we have in the game. Uh, so, but again, take that with a grain of salt. It is a limited time mount. Uh, as of filming this video, I think you only actually have one more day to purchase this mount. Um, so if you want to waste $3 million on it, knowing that it's probably going to get fixed, that's completely up to you. Uh, but who knows how long it'll take Cryptic to actually fix it is the key. So again, Giant Toad, which most people use single target. Um, my maximum hit was uh, 1.9 uh, and then you can look in the detailed logs 1.9 1.8 1.9 1.9 um, you can look at the base damage 3.1 3 mil 3.1 3 mil the effectiveness 62 percent um, I don't even recall what my stats are on preview how high my accuracy is on preview uh, but it is what it is guys it's just a short little video uh, I got questions about it. People were DMing me saying, should they waste the three million buying this thing? Um, they heard that it was broken. How broken is it? So, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, the testing doesn't lie, obviously. So if we bring it up again, like I said, uh, if you look at the base damage of Wicked, you know, you're looking at 4.3, 4.3, 4.3. 4 again, with my accuracy stat on preview, I was pumping out 3.3 million. Uh, so, again, it is based off physical damage. So, if you're a strength-based character, uh, if you're a barbarian, guardian, fighter, DPS, um, you know, ranger, rogue, then, yeah, you're going to be doing more damage. But as a intelligence-based character, such as wizard, necro, um, it's still worthwhile. You really can't not use it because it is going to do more damage than anything we have right now. Plus, you get that bonus 15% extra damage for 10 seconds. So, short little video today to answer some questions that people were DMing me about. Uh, yes, in my opinion, the mount is broken. Uh, it will probably get fixed ultimately. It's just a matter of when is it going to get fixed. Do you want to waste 3 million AD 
uh, buying it. Again, that's completely up to you. I can't tell you how to spend your money. Uh, but yeah, there's the tests on it. That's all I got for you guys today. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Just a short little video. Uh, slab of Vecna. Obviously someone coded it wrong. <laughs> uh, again, it's not taking into effect your accuracy stat. For whatever reason, it's doubling your combat advantage. I don't know what's going on. Uh, crypto going to do what crypto going to do. That's all I got for you folks today. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And I'll see you guys real soon.